Hello everyone. So I was trying to copy paste uh, some HTML in Hiccup online, and I kind of ended up with this monstrosity, right? Like, <laughs> there's no way I'm able to going to be able to format this properly. So I kind of kind of used some inbuilt Vim commands and then tried to uh, format this, right? But you can see it's it's completely completely haywired. There is one popular format tool which is CLJ FMT Closure Format. But it does not change the code structure, right? So if I have a map and a list, uh, a vector on the same line, it's not going to move those around. It's only going to change the current indentation. Like if it's, uh, if my view box is here, it's going to indent it properly. So we need something more. We need something uh, which provides a canonical format, which kind of forcefully uh, moves things around, changes the uh, structure of our code a little bit. I came across this uh, zprint library slash cri tool i think they're using graal vm to compile a binary which is really cool and uh, to be honest there's no installation uh, docs on their readme but uh, i kind of searched for zprint uh, emacs and i found this minor mode and it looks like this minor mode is uh, kind of downloading zprint for us so we don't need to do that so let's let's try to i haven't used it uh, yet let's try to do this so let's go back to Emacs. Okay, so let's just install this from the Melpa libraries. We'll do an uh, meta x package install. So I'm using Doom Emacs, and in Doom Emacs, uh, installing a package this way is not enough because when I restart Doom, uh, all of this is going to be lost. So I'll also uh, show you how I'll uh, set this in my configuration once we can uh, test this package out and see if it actually works. Okay, I think the package is installed. Let's just open up and let's see zprint. Okay, so they have two commands one is zprint and one is mode. Okay, so we don't need mode. I think reformat code using zprint that should be enough. So let's kind of uh, let's kind of highlight, let's just call this and see what happens, right? zprint. Okay, I think it might take a bit a uh, while because it's going to download the first time the zprint binary and bam, that's perfect, right? This is exactly what we wanted. Awesome. I think I think that's pretty much it, right? This is all we had to do to get zprint functionality. And this happens a lot when I'm writing code. You know, there's this one block of code which is not formatted properly. There's lines all over the place and I you know need to manually figure things out. And CLJ format does not help me in that. I'm not sure if they support something like that, but I haven't I haven't gotten around to using it that way. So yes, zprint was amazing. So let's uh, let me open config.el for doom and let me also open packages.el and let's add it here let's add a package let's call because it's zprint mode right we'll add a package here we'll go back to config kind of use package over here um and mode we can kind of Give it a mode or like a hook of when it kind of wants to uh, kind of do closure mode something like that yeah but we don't need this this should the package should be enough and now we can kind of do a doom reload and things should be set and ready to go and one more thing so since we have it installed let's kind of bind it to a key bind as well right so in Doom Emacs, how we would do this is we would kind of use a map and to the map, we are going to give uh, another map, which would be zprint mode. Okay, so we don't have a zprint map, so that's fine. So what we can do is we can give it a local leader. So I kind of want to press comma and let's say uh, comma and equal to sign, right? I think that should be nice because equal to does the normal formatting. So if I do a comma equal to that should pretty much highlight what I need. Okay, so uh, yeah, I think comma equal to is going to be a very reasonable default, uh, a reasonable key binding. So let's do that. Let's add equal to and let's add our quoted uh, zprint function, which is zprint. Let's see this. Browse. Okay, nope, it's giving an error. Um, non prefix key. Okay. Oh, okay, I think I'm missing the map uh, closure mode. Work. Yep. So that evolved perfectly. 
now I'm back in my closure file and you can see uh, I've just quickly written up this form over here which is kind of all over the place and let's kind of highlight only this part let's not uh, all zprint on the entire buffer uh, now I will hit comma and then an equal to and bam yep that's uh, a little wow right there so yep uh, I think this is awesome uh, I'm going to be using this a lot uh, I hope this was helpful to you if there are any issues with setting this up on Emacs, please do let me know in the comments below. If you want to kind of interact with uh, me and the entire Lambda Island team, uh, feel free to come and join us on our Discord uh, community. It's a very safe, uh, vibrant and safe place to discuss about closure. And uh, we are quite active. We uh, are also available in the voice chat. Uh, there are some really nice channels, which is game dev, creative coding, uh, special channel for beginners as well. So come hang out uh, on our ship.